Hey, what's good, y'all? It's your boy down from the Down Show in France, and we're back for another K pop reaction. Um, today, we're doing in hyping fever dance practice. Now, as you know, I was away for a minute for a couple days, maybe about a week or two, I'm not too sure. But uh, I had surgery, um, I am recovering. Um, so, if you notice, I don't react too much, like, you know, like saying anything loud or like not smiling that much. It's because, like, after the stitches are gone, I'm still healing. So the swelling went down, my skin color is coming back on my mouth. Um, I'll tell you later about the story about what happened to my mouth. Um, but if you notice that my reaction is a little mellow, it's not because I didn't like something, it's really because of the fact that my expression has to be careful so I won't uh, internally in my lip. It still hurts when I do certain things like pronouncing certain words, eating a certain way, and smiling. Even smiling and laughing is kind of hard sometimes. So if you notice that, don't take offense. I still need another two weeks to fully be at 100% and I am not at 100% yet. But I wanted to drop some videos for y'all because y'all been showing love in the comments and you know, I don't want to, you know what I'm saying, keep be away for too long. So I want to drop a whole bunch of videos for y'all. So same outfit, you know, we already know how it goes. Um, so I'm gonna drop a whole bunch and then uh, Carter will be on his way to do some uh, music videos as well, just to keep this page going because I know y'all enjoy these reactions and I just want to say thank you so much for the love. So please make sure you hit the subscribe button, ring that bell, leave comments. Um, we got more on the way, but as you can see, I don't really talk the same. Um, I'm still healing. So other than that, y'all, I want to do in hyphen fever dance practice. Um, I randomly just saw this and I was just like, yo, I did them a long time ago, but I want to kind of see what else they got. Um, and I want to show love, but trust and believe the other K-pop bands are on the way. I just had to take a break, but I got so much to catch up on. All right. So let's get right into it. Um, in three, two, one. Let's see what we got, y'all. Okay, vocals. Yeah. Yeah. Hey. Okay. Yes. 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 Mhm. Mm okay. So, first off, um, this is choreography season for me right now as a teacher um, and as a choreographer. So I'm gonna tell you one thing right now, what I like first off the song, I love the vocals. Um, I'm definitely gonna try to see what I can put on the caption so I can kind of hear the words. Um, so I wanna definitely check this out, but I love the intro, how they came in. You know what I'm saying? Like real simple and clean, you know what I'm saying? Like you can never go wrong with that because a lot of, uh, a lot of choreography out here nowadays be very radical and just look in any type of way. Real talk, um, seen it from experience. But the fact that this band has came in with a beautiful intro and from with the music. Yes, the music is muted because I just want y'all to see the, the intro. Like, just check this out, like how they come in. Very clean and just approaching it with the right texture. Eye connection with the video, moving real smoothly, coming up, taking your time and just letting the audience feel that, you know what I'm saying? So shout out to the choreographer and the director behind this, um, just the way they approach this. And then look how they're shaped, like everyone's together, all knees are bent, everyone knows where they're going. Honestly, you might not think that's a big deal. I'm telling you, people do get lazy on stage. Like that is a fact. Like people get lazy on stage, so the fact that they consistently practice in this and make sure it look good, cool. Another thing, shout out to them, Rock and Chuck Taylors because I struggle dancing in Chuck Taylors because my feet too big <laughs> and I do horrible dancing in Chuck Taylors. So let's continue going. Let's turn the music on. Mm. Goodness. I like their uh, formation, by the way. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Like the formation is really, really good. I love this formation. Uh, only because of the fact that they actually work in their levels and their grooves and like their level changes. Like if you go back just a little bit, just the way they, they rolling with this. Like they work in this. They work in that. Mm-hmm. Yes. Yeah. Uh-huh. 
Let's go. Hey. I like how like for me it's the pretty much everybody got like a quick duo or a quick solo. Wasn't that long, but it it meant something to the music. Like it was just wasn't a waste of time. You know what I'm saying? Like it was like it was meaningful. I like that. They real groovy. Hey, hey. Mmm. Get credit where it's due. Let's go. Hey. <laughs> hey, it's the little things for me. Let's go back a little bit. If I get quiet, y'all, it's because I'm still dealing with the pain. Mm. So watch this. I love this. Flowing with the music. Now right here, they about to do something crazy. Just like, just the way they approach this. I really like it. I like how they approach this. Check this out. Tap, tap, tap. Ugh. Tap, tap, tap. Yes. I love it that they, you know what I'm saying, they really know their track. Like, they know their track. Oh. Hey. Yes. Mmm. Levels. Oh, wow. Hey. Hey. Okay. 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 Yeah. Hey, first off, I know I can't really move this that much, but uh, let's keep it honest. Yeah, they tight. The song, I ain't talking about the choreography. I'm listening to the song. We already know the choreography type, but this song, I'm feeling it. Hey. Yes. Yes. Ah, very in sync. Very in sync. And I'm talking about the choreography, very in sync. First off, I know the song is not over, and I know the choreography is not over, but let me just be honest. I, I love the fact that they do something that is, you know, like when you do the hook or the chorus, you kind of know the choreography that's coming because they do it again. And you know that's like in choreography, not just in K-pop, but just like even if you watch like a Janet Jackson choreography. But in the middle of the process of this choreography, they kind of went back to the intro to kind of remind you, like, fever. That's what I'm peeping. The storyline in the choreography is showcasing itself. And shout out to them that got the whole water thing in the back because that's how you know they was in here putting in work. <laughs> Let's go. Yeah. Yes. Fever, fever. I like that. Let's go. Let's go. I love the fact that it's not a lot. It's not about like having a whole bunch of tricks. It's really to the point. And that's the thing. Like you can be real and like literally just be straight to the point with the choreo. Like I like this. I really, really, really do. Like I know I can't really like express because um, of my mouth. But for real, for real, I really did enjoy this because it's like. And they didn't put a whole bunch of like like tricks in here. It was like real groovy, just the way the, the song feels. Uh, I'm gonna play the choreography while I'm talking so you can kind of get an idea of what I'm talking about. It's like they they wasn't trying to put a whole bunch of like tricks in there and you know, all these things here. They, they wasn't trying to add all that. What it was, it kept it groovy and consistent. Like they, they had the grooves, they had the movements. It was like straight to the I know what we're on. So the choreographer or the choreographers that put this together for these artists, 
really knew what they was doing for this. Even if it was them that choreographed this, like you look at this, like they kept a consistency about a flow and the grooves. Like it's consistent throughout the whole choreography. And I think like for me that like, that actually like sends a message to me as a teacher and as a choreographer, like make sure you try to stay consistent in some type of form in your dance and in your piece, especially when you're making up something for a band that has to still sing on stage and tour and still keep the crowd interacting because it ain't nothing better when you see a band on stage and you see some dancing. I mean, honestly, we can go all the way back to the Temptations. We can go back to the old days, the OJs and all of that, the seventies music and all. And the one thing you would love to see is when you see a live performance and one thing I learned about the K-pop world is that y'all really get crazy with these tours and these live shows because y'all are stacking out these concerts. And one thing I had observed was that they keep y'all moving and grooving. And I love that. Like that, that's, that's dope. Like keep that going, y'all. Um, but other than that, I really enjoyed this choreography. Um, I actually enjoyed the song too. I know that my friends and family that do watch this is like, yeah, we're gonna download the track. So um, thank y'all so much for like speaking on all these bands for me to find and do my own homework. I do my best not to watch them um, outside of me doing the videos because I just want to be able to have a real review or reaction. I don't want to have anything prepared. I like freestyling my reactions and let it be genuine. So. Other than that, y'all, uh, I'm going to keep doing some videos until my mouth doesn't feel well. Uh, thank y'all so much for the love and support. Uh, thank you for praying for me. Um, I, I do got, I get feeling back in my right side more and more every single day. Um, but other than that, y'all, I'm going to make some more videos before I have to rest. I appreciate y'all so much. I'll see you again soon in the next video. Take care, y'all. Peace.